Tip of the day. Another 10 classic Windows errors episodes are past. You know what to do. What? Delete them. Show them the door. Take them out to a fancy dinner. Criticize them strongly and make them feel bad. Let them use the computer and get frustrated at their own kind. Get some bombs and blow them up. I mean, your statement's kind of open-ended here. Be specific. Okay, who forgot to secure the intro video properly? Tip of the day. You can read the contents of an error by reading the contents of an error. So cool, isn't it? You can also eat food by eating food, look at the sky by looking at the sky, and make bacon mad by saying gold is better. Bacon, 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 bacon. How bacon dare you? You made bacon mad. Gold is bacon inferior to bacon in every bacon way possible. Bacon's gonna bacon get you for that. Bacon, 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 Are you Siri? No, rest assured, I'm just Joe. Don't be afraid. What is three apples plus five oranges? Come on, that's literally comparing apples to oranges. Um, um, if I was to make an educated guess, I would choose eight. Wrong. The answer is 16. Really? Where'd you come up with such a random- Oh. What have I done? Get ready for SS Trace, releasing on a computer near you. What is this? Why is my computer only showing text? I know I installed Windows Vista on here 30 minutes ago. Whoa, they sure weren't kidding. Windows Defragmenter is fragmented. Please defragment Windows Defragmenter to defragment your computer. Okay, so, after I defragment my defragmenter, my defragmented defragmenter will defragment my fragmented computer. Oh man, now my mind is fragmented. Dumb defragmenter. What's inside these windows inside this computer inside the screen? HMMMM. It might be viruses. Best to stay away. Why you still use floppy disks in 2019? Because my CD drive exploded. The one time I trust SecretSoft, they blow it. Figures. Besides, floppies aren't that bad in our universe. I'll survive. This is an error message. Oh wowzers. I never knew that in all my life. Fun fact, this icon isn't a donut. You got that right, error. It's actually a bunch of grapes. I can't believe you'd miss something as simple as that. Windows has locked your keys. You must enter your product key again to get your keys unlocked. I can't, stupid error. My product keys are stored in a super secure safe, and I can't unlock it without my keys. Besides, I already reactivated you at least 136 times in this computer alone. Give me back my keys. This error broke. Oh great. Now the error can't function like a normal error. I'm going to have to get tucks over here again. Nuts. Hi, I'm Repairman Tux. What needs fixing? Go fix that error over there. Okay, Sam. Sure can do. Okay, Sam. It's fixed. How is it fixed? You destroyed my computer. What a lousy repairman. I'm never calling him again. Tip of the day. Sam Joe reached 1,000 subscribers. Let's celebrate with a round of errors that will make you rage. Hey, look. Sam Joe got to an amazing milestone. Let's make a third party suffer for no reason to celebrate. Oh, who am I kidding? The decade's almost over. Every torture in the series has already been thrown at me. What could go wrong now? Windows response is not responding. Please respond. Uh, Sam? What in the world are you doing? Oh, forget it. I'll just eat all your tacos. Wait, what? 
There's way too many twos in this episode's number. Hey, calm down. There's only two. Also, this is the second time you've used this error. Get it out of here. Dude, where in the world is NSC ses 5 e 10 Uh, I know where it is. It's on Sam Joe's hard drive. We are content control. We have censored the rest of this error and the other S5E10 errors, because S5E10 has already been released. Sorry for the inconvenience. Good day, all. The 2010's decade is 99.9% .9 complete. Oh no! Where has all the time gone? I thought we were still in 2015. Well, you know what they say, time marches on. No! Come back! Oh, you have got to be joshing me. Surprise! It's us, Content Control. Yeah, we were hoping we wouldn't appear, either. But alas, some idiot used a joke from an outside source, in this case, a Garfield comic strip bag. We have punished the idiot by adding five more errors to the episode. Thank you, and we wish you a happy new decade. Care to use Internet Exploder just one more time this decade? No. Absolutely not. I ditched Internet Exploder for Firefox long ago. Besides, a new Chromium Edge Explode is rolling out to Windows 11 users soon. Not like I care, oh. Go back to the mysterious void of deletion. Windows 7 is going to be unsupported in 14 days. Alas, poor traditional Windows. You were a wonderful series of operating systems. May Windows Tablet Edition forever take your place. Ha. Huh. Microsoft gave me the Windows 7 SU Pack for Christmas. Now I got support until January 10th, 2023. Windows 7 ain't dead yet, son. Oh, how nice. Enjoy overpaying for your updates, Anna. Why is the 3DS still alive in 2020? Because it's an awesome video game system. Granted, I haven't touched my 3DS for two years, but it's still epic. Plus, the Switch doesn't have all the charm the 3DS does. Hint hint, pedometer and street pass. Besides, I want to see the little guy make it to 10 years before it dies. You're running low on data this month. Data plan, 1024 megabytes. Data used, 1023 megabytes. Oh come on, I just got my data renewed yesterday. Who in the world of annoying errors is using all my data? Data, data, makes more data. Data, 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 data has arrived. Is Dickens data lead brother in law? We're data related through my data lead brother, Taco Dickens data lead sister Jewel. The two data them eventually got data lead married. Data, 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 data likes to eat 5 terabytes of data for breakfast, 16 terabytes for lunch, and 32 terabytes for data dinner. Dinner data is data delicious. Data, 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 oops, my system crashed. I lost my data, but I had an empty virus. Data, 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 Twenty twenty is negative point three percent complete. Nuts, the new year is passing by fast already. I need to use rocket boosters to catch up. The pitch of your voice is wrong. Please go to voice options to fix this. Yeah, yeah, I know voice options is misspelled in Spigonia, but Spigonia is not getting any more updates. We'll have to live with the misspelling forever. <laughs> Windows Defragmenter has defragmented your used bombs. However, they are very unstable. What? You defragmented my bombs? No 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 get out of here we are going to be exp- We are now deleting all the data off your hard drive. No, data should not let this happen. Data should unplug the data with power cord. Data, data, data. Hey, thanks data. You saved my data. No data leak problem. Data will now buy 404 terabytes worth of hard drives now. Data, 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 data. Go on ahead, data. Make sure you buy it with Scotty's money. He keeps stealing mine. Quick. There's only negative six more days until Christmas. Start your shopping now. Oh no, I put off my shopping way too late. Better go right this instant. If I'm lucky, I'll be able to get my presents to the studio by New Year's. Hope everyone's content with getting my presents. Your data is being collected by Google, Microsoft, Comcast, Facebook, Twitter, your browser cookies, the system RAM, the internet, your dog, and... What? 
No. Why did my computer shut off? Ah, Jim has just disconnected your hard drive full of data from your data computer. See how it Jim is going to data. Keep all the data on this data disk. Data, 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 data. Get back over here. I got all kinds of files on there that are older than you know. Stop counting. Wait, he's going after my sweet diary. Don't you touch sugar, sugary diary. All the sweet stuff in your sugary. Be taken nice to my best bacon friends. You and bacon, we diary. Eat bacon, 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 bacon. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. It's always a blast to have data around. Alas, the 2010s have come to a close. It was quite an eventful decade. The 2020s are sure to be even bigger. Now, let's close the decade with a bang. Ah yes. These past 10 years have certainly been huge. I mean, Sam Joe went from a private fledgling notebook series to a fledgling YouTube channel with single-digit subscribers, and now has two YouTube channels at 1,000 subscribers. Truly, this has certainly been the biggest decade he's ever experienced. Thank you all for supporting the channels for all these years. And get ready. The next decade will be even bigger. Trust me. And, wait a second. We are going to end with a bang. <laughs> Tip of the day. Jump over the lazy dog 1,234,567,890 times. Why? Is the quick brown fox in vacation? Also, why can't that lazy muck jump 1.23 billion times instead? It needs to get some exercise for once. Oh, forget this. Time to jump 9,876,543,210 times in Super Mario Bros. That speedrunning trick is torture to pull off. I am an error. I do not care. I am calling you a nuisance, whether you like it or not. Now let me use my computer. We just moved random parts of your Vegas Pro project by 0.000 frames in either direction. You can thank us later. Thanks. You only costed me an extra hour in editing. Sure glad this feature exists and auto-executes randomly. I mean, seriously. Why does this incredibly annoying occurrence exist? The copy-paste method and the auto-ripple features are incredibly hindered by these random 0.000 frame nudges. It even applies to keyframes, thus resulting in random video errors like this. See? Your system has been downgraded to 640 kilobytes of RAM. That ought to be enough for everyone, especially you. I mean, who uses that much RAM? Well, this is a wild guess, but I'd say just about everyone these days. We're not in the age of MS-DOPS anymore. Although Mike might be. Hey. Not true. I have the latest hardware available as of 1981. You're just jealous. <laughs> he ran out of memory. Oh no. I'm a bit low in ran my sir. 16, 16. Oh no, you don't. Why? <laughs> Whoa, where am I? Oh. Hello, our visitor. Welcome to England. What? Da, dumb 16s, sending me to the United Kingdom, while I had an expired passport. Huh? What United Kingdom are you talking about? This is England. You don't mind me asking what year it is, do you? Oh. That's just as well. Today is the 25th of March, which officially marks the new year of 1616. Kind of odd, though, since we the people celebrate it on the 1st of January with the rest of Europe. Oh. Thanks. Do you mind, if I just explode right here? Well, no, just as long as I'm a safe distance away. Farewell, kind sir. Farewell. <laughs> 16 has upgraded your computer to Windows 16. Enjoy the familiar ominousness. Don't you follow in Secret Soft's footsteps, you scary numbers! It's bad enough that you sent me back in time to the 17th century. But stuff will get real bad between us, if you start ripping off Microsoft stuff as well. Give me back Windows XP, before I wipe you plumb off the number line. Don't make us upgrade you to Windows 20. I see you've made some headway already, eh? 
Fine then. Let's see what these dumb operating systems are made of. In order for Windows 16 to work properly, we changed your file system to FAT16. No prob, pal. I can totally make do with a maximum storage capacity of literally 2 gigabytes. I'll only need to make like 75 more partitions to use all the space in my hard drive. Windows 95 Nostalgia, here I come. Please agree to the Windows 16 DULA. I don't see why not. May as well see what you're going to force me to abide by anyway. You are completely fine with random numbers coming out of your computer. Meh, whatever. Happens all the time. Although it stinks when they send me backwards in time. You are completely fine with using 16-bit color mode. 16-bit is almost as good as 32-bit color, so I don't really care. You are completely fine with eating my way cookies with a 16 as the icing. Okay I'm not gonna lie that actually sounds delicious. Agree? Hey, these terms actually aren't that bad, so why not? Besides, they'll end once the source is inevitably removed from my computer. Except. Try 16 flavored ice cream. It tastes like orange crush. Buy 16 cartons for $116.16. Awesome. Sugar meat sugary ice cream that tastes like crush. Please sell sugary please. Only if you buy it with your own money. Okay sugar soft Sam. Quick. Wait a second I have my card link. Yeah, 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 yeah. We now sugar have 16 more cartons of sugary ice cream. I can't sugar wait. Sugar sugar needs more sugar. Fine. But now you owe me $116. Have you ever met 16's dad, 61? Uh, no, and please don't introduce- <laughs> Windows 16 is bored of you. You will not be upgraded to Windows 20 anyway. Da, 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 da. You got my hopes up. Oh well, Windows 20 can't possibly be as bad as Windows 16, right? Please, tell me I didn't jinx myself. Please. Welcome to Windows 20, the OS that's twice as good as Windows 10. Well, the FEMA is twice as good as Windows 10's, so I'll give you that. It better have twice as good substance to go with those looks, oh. I'm not joking, if it's only one point infinite nines times better, then I'm removing it on the spot. To create more consistency with Microsoft, Windows 20 has ditched Internet Exploder in favor of Secret Soft Edge Explode. Consistency, you say? I see you're just trying to copy the competition. Hint hint, Google with the dumb abbreviated subcounts. Also, you broke Edge Explode when you switched its code base to Chromium. It doesn't explode all the time anymore. Now it's dead in the water, it was supposed to blow the competition out of the water. Oh well. Let me just click this little button. A new feature update is available for Windows 20. Version 2020, nicknamed the Twin 20s update. Install. Either Windows 20 is an idiot and thinks there's a 20th month in the year, or it uses the 4-digit year instead of the 2-digit year month scheme Microsoft uses. I'm leaning towards the former. Also, why not go ahead and install it? I backed up my files yesterday, so deleting them will do you no good anyway. Ha. Do your worst, Windows 20. An error occurred, while updating. Ha, that all you got? How pathetic. Your hardware was not manufactured in 2020. Yeah, because it was made in 2004. I got this computer, when it was brand spanking new. Oh wait, that makes it 60. Yeah, moving on. Us, you are ineligible for the update, and for Windows 20 itself. Duh, how pitiful. I'm not eligible for a Windows knockoff you forced me to install. You will now be downgraded to Windows 2.0. Okay, no lie, I actually wasn't expecting that. Oh well, at least it's an official Microsoft OS. It's just an old one. But at least I'll have a better chance at installing Windows XP. Goodbye Windows 20, it wasn't nice knowing you. See you in 4040. Your computer is too new for Windows 2.0. Upgrading to Windows 10. Figures. Wait, does Windows 10 even work in the Dell Dimension 4700? Wow. Learn something new every day. Hopefully Windows 10 will let me downgrade to Windows XP anyway. We accidentally downgraded you to Windows 1.0. Upgrading to Windows 10 for real. Okay that happened. How could you possibly mistake Windows 1.0 for Windows 10? Well, this code is pretty old, so I might give it a break. Or a continue. Or go, oh goodness I couldn't give it a go to. Go to is just death. Anyways, 
Go to Windows 10. Your computer cannot run on Windows 10. Downgrading to a previous version of Windows. Hey, 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 hey. You said Windows 10 would work. Oh well, I don't care. Less work I have to do. Windows XP here I come. Hey, 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 hey. Windows XP cannot be installed in a FAT16 partition. Downgrading to Windows 95. Nuts. Nuts, nuts, nuts. I forgot to reformat the file system. No, 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 come back. Don't downgrade in me. Welcome to the latest edition of Windows. Start multitasking. Start Windows 95. Hey, thanks. I'll be sure to make great use of this totally brand new operating system. It's the latest version as of 1995. And my first act in this clean install shall be a reformat to MTFS. This episode is out of time. Shutting down. Ta. Uh, uh, uh. See you guys. I have to go vent out my frustration by downgrading the studio's computers to Windows 98 real quick. See you sometime later. <laughs> An error occurred while loading tip of the day.exe. 16.dll is missing or corrupt. Oh yeah. That's a thing in Windows 95. Nothing works in it anymore. Oh well, at least that means those dumb numbers don't work here either. Still need to get back to Windows XP ASAP. Oh. This error contains an error. H -m 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 -m. This error contains a title, a dumb description, a button I never read, an icon, a grayed out close button, but no error. This error is an error. There's no error in this error. It needs more errors. <laughs> Somebody stole my trig identities. Oh no. How is Mike going to pass his calculus to exam now? Wait what? On your marks. Get set. Go. Time up. Microsoft Mike, you got a zero on the exam. I have a zero tolerance stance for such poor performance. I will now downgrade your computer to Windows Zero. No 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 please don't my Windows 7 product keys aren't good anymore no. Whatever you do, no. don't let the OS divide by zero. You could destroy all kinds of stuff that way. Your fabric has been fabricated. What? You mean to tell me that the fabric guy fabricated a lie? Mary, that guy sold you fake fabric. What? You mean to tell me that this fabric is not fabric? What is it, then? Oh. It's just a bunch of styrofoam. I'm never going to the fabulous funny fabric store again. Ah uh, well. Maybe you'll have better luck at Honest Frogrex fabricated fabric. Windows cannot burn to CD. The disk drive overheated. What? Why can't you burn the CD? I got a bunch of secrets on here I need to get rid of. That's it. Time to put a bomb in the disk drive. Maybe that'll work. Bombs? Windows 95 has encountered a floating point error while calculating today's date. Today is by day. Whoa, Pi? Oh good. Why is the new 16 around here? No, not literally. Please leave me alone. This error is password protected. Enter the password to access this error. No. I don't like having to go through errors. But just for the sake of it, I'll try anyway. The password is password. I'm calling it now. Wrong password. Oh, whatever. Nothing bad could have possibly come out of that. Sam. Your taco vault just locked up and is now inaccessible. Your usual password doesn't work on it anymore either. It just happened 10 seconds ago. You're bluffing. Let me go check. What? Nuts. You're right. My no commotive goes new. Impossible new. I'll never guess a password again. Chug it, chug it, chug it. Somebody deleted my cache cache. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. You put too much in Windows 95's memory. It can only handle up to a maximum of $2,621.44 in its cache. A cache stash greater than that will cause the OS to delete every single penny of it. Oh wait. I almost have that much in my computer. Better reinstall Windows XP fast, then. Mm -hmm. It's not going to let me install Windows XP directly, so I'm going to destroy Windows 95 with viruses instead. Wish me luck, guys. Internet Explorer cannot open the Internet site www.virus.com. An unexpected error has occurred. 
Restart Internet Explorer, and then try again. Oh, whoops. I forgot. Internet Explorer 5.5 can't load stuff anymore. Oh well, no problem. I can just install Firefox and get to virus.com from there. An error occurred while opening Firefox.exe. Some random .dll does not exist. Oops, again. I forgot nothing worked on Windows 95 anymore. Fine. I'll shut down the OS and hope it'll let me get to the BIOS boot menu instead. Shutdown.exe has performed an illegal operation. There. I shut down the computer myself by a perfectly legal operation, pulling the plug. Now, let's reinstall Windows XP once and for all. Task failed successfully. Duh. I botched up the installation. Oh well, at least it didn't succeed at failing. Guess I'll make do with what I've got. We are the bad C++ programmers. Let's take a break from reading errors and then continue once we go to System32 and delete it. You idiot! You used the forbidden C++ commands! You doomed us all! No 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 We upgraded your computer to Windows 96 to celebrate St. Patrick's Day. No 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 why you have to downgrade my computer at the end of the episode curse you secrets off to Tip of the day. It's very risky to have an insecure pin. Ha, jokes on you. While your Microsoft account folks have to sign in with a pin in Windows 10, I get to log on to Epic Windows XP with a plain old password. No thank you, I will not take on a simplistic smartphone-esque feature for my superior desktop computer. Now I'm just going to st- No! In the world left a straight push pin straight up- Oh man I have to get my metal toe repaired- Sam, I told you to put your wall calendar back on the wall two hours ago. Now the thumbtack is destroyed. I'll have to pre-order another one. Today's date was not found. Whoa. It's 4.04 today. Wait, where is my keyboard and mouse? <laughs> it is I, Internet Explorer 6. I hid your keyboard and mouse behind the 404 error. Good luck getting them back. Now don't mind me, I'm just a little hungry for some cookies. Hey, 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 hey. Keep your lack of hands off my way cookies. Phew. Good thing it's easy to catch that trickster. The thing can't run fast enough to save its own user base. Your sub broke down. Oh no. My poor sub. Some idiot filled its tank with the juice from juice of the day. Now I have to get it a peppermint oil change. It doesn't like pumpkin spice. First, there was Windows 9X. Then, there was Windows 10X. Introducing the latest and greatest OS line you've ever seen, Secret Soft Windows 11X. Coming soon to computers near you in February 29, 2021. Sheesh. Secret Soft needs to cool it with these dumb knockoffs. The 9X line has been dead for almost 20 years now, and Windows 10X isn't even out yet. Also, February 29 doesn't exist, at least not in 2021. That's it. Time to remove Windows 96. Thanks for trying Windows 96. Forced to use is a more accurate term. How might we improve this version of Windows to enhance our experience? Ooh, I know. You could delete it forever. I'm going to send a delete system for D to command over the internet to Secretsoft. <laughs> now to enjoy an actually good version of Windows. Welcome to Windows No, the first OS in the 9X line, since Windows ME. No 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 no. I thought I was free from these stupid clones. That's it. Time to nuke the computer. No 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 no. It didn't affect the OS, and now my room is destroyed. Fine, let's try upgrading to Windows XP directly. Please answer the question to continue. Are you sure you want to upgrade from Windows No? What? All the options say no. No 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 no. I have to get rid of this stupid OS, even if it takes using the Uno reverse card to do it. We bet you can't solve the tangent of 90 degrees. <laughs> nice try, Windows No. I am very highly proficient in trigonometry, although I bond my calculus one class. This expression is... No, 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 it's actually one divided by zero, you tripped me with... Internet Exploder cannot explode. Windows no said no to it. G R R R R. I changed the UAC permissions, yes they actually added UAC, and this dumb OS still won't hit. Oh forget it. I'm restarting after one more error. Checkmate. 
Windows has a bad case of writer's cube. Oh no. I heard that's three times as bad as writer's block. I don't want to get infected. Must we start now? Phew. That was a close one. Now let's install Windows XP. Wait a second. Why did this show up before the BIOS screen? We noticed you like talking about lady voices, so we upgraded your computer to Windows mic to better suit lady voices like you. Hey, 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 hey. I don't talk like a lady, you dumb OS. That's the last straw, time to format the hard drive. This user has performed an illegal operation and will be shut down. Stop right there, Microsoft Sam. We are the Lizzie Police. We caught you performing an illegal operation. You are now under Al's arrest. Go to the designated room upstairs now. What? Don't make me confiscate your computer too. No, not my computer. Okay, I will go now. Okay, now that that's done. Stop right there, Microsoft Mike. We are the Livy Police. We caught you not preventing Sam from committing an illegal operation. What? You're not going to send me to the Livy Jail, are you? Not quite. We will now force you to use this stupid secret soft OS. Tip of the day. Dihydrogen monoxide is totally healthy for you. Yes, it's quite a refreshing substance indeed. Let me consume some right now. Uh, that was some refreshing dihydrogen monoxide. Good whole H2O. Nice try trying to get me scared of water. An error has occurred. And no, we are not going to tell you why. We are Windows, the boy. You bought a Windows PC, so you're obligated to get errors. Find the problem yourself. Alas, this was how Windows functioned back in the 1990s. Good times. A lot better than Windows 10 and its emphasis on removing technical details and adding a patronizing wording scheme. I wish we could go back to the good old Windows and its spontaneous blue screens. Windows is not confident in your confidential information. Well, you better keep it confidential. Otherwise, I'll lose my confidence in you. Actually, I never had confidence in SecretSoft at the start. Your stuff is stuffed. Dude. Uncool. Why did you stuff my stuff in the stuffed garbage can? That irritates the stuffing out of me. Give me back my stuff or else I'll stuff your stuff with explosive stuff. Windows has detected that you have hippopotamonstrosa squipedaleophobia. Ha. Huh. Preposterous. I am totally comfortable with long words. I know quite a few myself, including this one and triskaidekaphobia, fear of the number 13. Triskaidekaphobia isn't nearly as prominent in this universe as hexakaidekaphobia, though. That's fear of the fourth power of two. Windows has detected bugs in your private conversation. What? I told you to keep my confidential information confidential. How could you let these bugs bug my private confidential conversation? I didn't know Mike liked first grade. This conversation is a gold mine for my Facebook. Excuse me for a minute, while I force Scotty to delete that information from his memory and computer. <laughs> Windows Mike has heard enough of your lady's voice. We're out. You joke, my speech has no feminine characteristics at all. Also, good. Now I can restore Sam's computer to Windows XP and be free of this slanderous operating system. Introducing SecretSoft Windows XQ, SecretSoft's better foray into the video game market. Bah, that's a disappointment. Windows XP still isn't restored. Oh well, at least the OS isn't a deliberate shot at my voice. Now to remove this double clone before it forces me to play Sonic Boom and Wii Sports Club. Pizza pie, pizza pie. Oh no. Pizza pie, pizza pie, pizza pie, pizza pie, pizza pie, pizza pie, pizza pie. We ran out of letters to represent these episodes. You idiot, you broke the fourth wall and the fourth screen. Now I have to both fix the fourth wall and buy Sam a new $560 4K monitor. Unfortunately, Windows has stopped. Oh good, now this OS is trying to be Android. Windows doesn't stop, it crashes or stops working. It never just stops. Allow me to throw a proper exception to demonstrate. An error occurred, while throwing an exception. The exception missed. Whoops. Oh no! 
It gets my supply of Coke and pizza. Pizza pie. Get away pizza from pie, there, Mike. See that Coke pie, and pizza all belong to me, and you can't have it now. Go eat your own Pepsi and pizza pie. pie. Wow, what's their problem? We can always go to Little Caesars and Speedway to get more pizza and soda. Oh well. Let me see if I can do something on this computer. Tip of the day. Microsoft David is more epic than Microsoft Sam. Ha 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 ha. You got that right? Finally, somebody knows the truth. Fat chance, bub. I already defeated Microsoft Anna in that department years ago, and I ain't gonna lose to you and your dumb simplistic emulation of Windows. By defeated, you mean you two got into a big fight in 2004 and only made up when Clippy took over Microsoft headquarters. And you made most of the concessions, including the position of Windows Vista's default voice. Dude, I'm cool. How do you know? I studied Microsoft's history during my first year of activation, so I even know about the Windows 1.0 days. Oh well, Windows Vista was a big failure anyway. Don't forget that Anna was also on Windows 7, which garnered more users than Windows XP ever did. Yeah, but it was still Windows Vista under a different Wait, name. Wait, aren't you still under house arrest for committing an illegal operation? <laughs> Okay, you win this time, I'm leaving, don't tell the lady police in me, buddy. Ha. Huh. That was easy. Now to prove myself by removing the secret soft knockoff and installing Windows 10. No longer will the question what version of Windows are you using be relevant. Everyone will be on Windows 10. The question what version of Windows 10 are you using will be relevant instead. Ah uh, yes, this will clear up so much confusion. Everyone will understand what's going wrong, and they'll totally be able to solve their problems using a solution for a completely different version of Windows 10. I can't wait to upgrade this computer to this utopian operating system. Let's do it now now now. Sorry. Windows XU does not allow OS changes. Your computer will have Windows XU forever. No 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 no. What a disappointment. I'll have to see if I can override this later, because I hate secret soft operating systems even more than Windows XP. Tired of ads. We are too. Here's a subtract. Nah, I prefer multiplications of my dividends. My happiness goes up exponentially, because the root of my problems is solved. Your derivative doesn't solve the integral problem, wise guy. Hippity hoppity, the ceiling is now my property. No you. You can't have it, Tux. I worked hard on that ceiling. <laughs> Do it, loser. It's all mine now. Now, I'm off to plug it off to make a quick buck. See you never. That's it, I'm calling the Libby police on your sorry penguin hide. You should have never set foot in this domain, you immature brat. We <coughs> Project Floppy was a flop. Bummer. There goes my top secret floppy disk revival. Oh well, I'm not interested in this old piece of junk storage medium anymore. Digital cloud storage and solid state drives all the way. Your weight weight is getting too heavy. Upgrade your computer or it will collapse. Man. My internal system is going really slow these days. It feels like it weighs over 50 hours. That's what I get for choosing a hard drive instead of an SSD. You know what, after I'm done here, I'm going to get in tip-top time shape. Wow, try saying that five times fast. It's under 9000. What? Oh nuts. I used a subtract instead of an add. Now I don't have enough power to fire my laser. No. The E in this error is pretty smug. You don't say. That little trickster must be up to something. I hope it ain't nothing bad. E. What? It's E. I don't quite understand. The only joke you need to understand is E. It's a very useful number in calculus. Oh really? What is it then? I'm glad you asked. It is exactly 2.718288459045235360987417156497257507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507507
No more pre-Windows 8 stuff. You're just biased, David. No you. File Exploder accidentally nuked your hard drive. You idiot. I wanted to replace Microsoft Sam's computer's hard drive, not blow it or its data up. Now you're gonna get Sam really mad at me. Oh, like I'm not already mad at you already. Be quiet Sam, and go back to enjoying your house arrest in peace. Windows 10 is the worst operating system ever. What is this blasphemy I don't even- Oh forget it. Time to get real. I'm upgrading this computer to Windows 10, whether it likes it or not. We already told you Windows XU doesn't allow OS changes you idiot. Well let's see if the power cares. Ha. Huh. Doesn't look like it. Goodbye forever Windows XU. Now time to install Windows 10. Welcome to Windows X. You smart Alex, you think you can trick me with another Windows XP inspired clone and a Mac OS naming scheme. Get this poor excuse of an operating system off this computer before I personally go to Secret Soft HQ and completely wipe their databases. Welcome to Windows, Simplistic Edition. That is, Windows 10. You ain't fooling me. Windows 10 features the number representation, not the word representation. You must die, you clone. Installation of Windows 10 is complete. Yay 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 yay. Finally. Victory has been achieved. Score 1 for David. Ha 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 swa 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 swa. Now to upgrade all of Microsoft Sam's programs to their Windows 10 equivalents. Tip of the day. It's that day again. You know what that means. Ah uh, yes. It's this channel's homeland's national birthday today. Today, we get to celebrate by shooting off tons of colorful fireworks into the night sky while eating hot dogs and burgers and drinking soda. A very special time indeed. Today is the 4th of July 2020. No you, it's July 4th, 2020. We Arithmicans do some things differently around here, Don Chuck no. Just because you have Windows 10 installed doesn't mean you're free from these out of the ordinary error messages. Figures. Well, bring it on again, then. I'll defeat you jokers just like I did last time in installing Windows 10. This time, we fight to the death. The death of either one of our epicness points, that is. Prepare yourselves, stupid errors. Introducing the beefer, an alternative to the hammer. Soon, we'll have the cheeser available as well. Oh goody. Finally some more variety in the Mac hardware menu. Now I don't have to repair the ceiling using just the ham hardware. Hopefully we can get the bacon or later down the line as well. Needs more bacon. This just in, Apple announces Mac OS 11 after 20 years of Mac OS X. Wait. That's illegal. I thought Apple was going to stay on Mac OS 10 forever and ever. Now Microsoft is bound to make a Windows 11. No oh 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 Zero one zero one one zero one 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 zero one zero zero one zero 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 one one zero two zero one zero one zero one one zero one zero. Ah yes, good old binary. Wait, I see that too. This ain't binary; it's just a bunch of random numbers. Thanks for wasting my time and vocal cord strength. Error. Your OP laser cannon is broken. Ha 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 ha. Deal with it. I'm a fire in my laser. That's what it meant by broken. Rats. Now I have to go back to Microsoft HQ and get it fixed. <coughs> Windows 11 when? Never. We shall have Windows 10 forever and ever and ever and ever. At least I hope. Boy does Mac OS 11 scare me. Microsoft said Windows 10 was the last version of Windows. Introducing Microsoft Door, the successor to Windows. Fake. Not real. Besides, Microsoft already tried replacing Windows with a house-oriented OS, Microsoft Bob, and it failed miserably. There's no possible way Microsoft would do something like that again. Get Secret Soft's disguised ad out of here before I call Mac Alex over here to kick it. Windows 10 is tired of existing. Installing a different OS. No 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 stop it stop it cancel cancel please don't go away from me Windows 10 I need to preserve my epicness points a a a a a a a a a a We installed Windows 76 on your computer to celebrate Independence Day. Gee, thanks for adding insult to injury. This isn't what I wanted. Excuse me, 
I'm going to try to send this inferior knockoff into the sky and make it explode into a zillion colors. Wish me luck. My raffle copter doesn't go soy 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 soy. Sounds like you need some soy sauce. Natural Sam has plenty, so go ahead and ask him for some. We are proud to release Internet Exploder version 1776.7.4. Included in this release are graphical improvements to the explosions, where they look more colorful and can make all kinds of cool sound effects and images. Whatever, I don't care. It'll just make this OS explode into fireworks when I inevitably send it off into the sky. Ha 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 ha. Nothing. No. There's nothing to rage at or make fun of in this error. This error doesn't even exist. WHYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYYY
A series on event four around here. Your rook is a rookie. Rook, you idiot. You can jump over your own pawns. No, you can't castle through check either. Ah. Good job. You just let the opponent capture you unopposed. Now my other rook is doomed, and possibly the entire game as well. Your electrician has been grounded for his shocking actions. I'm shocked. He's at 12 of our good computers with static electricity. Those computers had electrifying performance. That's it, we're switching to a more enlightened electrician, lightning fast. Zero. Wow, is that it? Nothing more than that? What a joke. That's so null. Want a faster web browsing experience and don't want to use Internet Exploder? Just switch to Secret Soft Firebomb. It's 10% faster, 5% more efficient, 20% easier to use, 16% more code, 30% more browser like, 150% more disk space required. Huh, as if percentage increases are going to impress me. Internet Exploder isn't even worth comparing to. That's not much improvement at all. Come on, Secret Soft. Download today for free. Paying all microtransactions required. Yeah, suddenly I don't wanna use this browser at all. Microtransactions are just scams. I'll be using Safari instead, thank you very much. Think different. Get Windows 10. No you! Everyone's getting Windows 10 now! How is that thinking different? That's it, this OS must die now 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 now. Today's fortune, your company will soon become Microsoft Apple. No way! Not happening in a million years! I can't believe the term Microsoft Apple can actually be thought up. You know what? That's the last straw. Forget playing these errors into giving me a favorable option. I'm gonna force them to accept Windows XP right now. If we catch you trying to install Windows XP, we will fry your computer beyond repair. Well, you should have thought about that before sharing the atrocity of an idea of a Microsoft Apple merger. Besides, is that all you got? Come on. I've seen bigger threats from Nintendo 3DS system messages before. Proceed with the Windows XP installation. Win OS X has detected a Windows XP installation disk. Please wait while we destroy your computer. Oops. Totally didn't mean to leave my hand on the Surge Protector switch. Now let's turn this thing back on and reinstall Windows XP already. Huh. Win OS X also covers the BIOS. No matter, I'll just flip the switch again, and use the BIOS override. The user needs permission in order to power off the computer. Come on, why aren't you powering off? This computer's not connected to any other power source. Oh, we forgot to mention that we downloaded a battery ju- Inconceivable. Well played, secret song. Huh. That's your some downloadable battery right there, failing only 20 seconds into its life. Life story of pretty much anything else Secret Soft makes. Pathetic. Now to reinstall Windows XP unopposed with a BIOS override. Ha 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 ha. Windows XP encountered an error during installation. The user is an Apple voice. Well, it's not that I actually like Windows. I'm just doing Microsoft Sam a favor and reinstalling it on his computer. And I've already established the fact that Mac OS doesn't belong on Windows computers. That's an opinion, not a fact. Be quiet, Kathy. I thought you were playing with Alex in Mario Kart or something. Okay then. Also, computer, the installation already completed, so I can just task manager my way out of this error. Huh. You thought I wasn't proficient in Windows, didn't you? We are removing the ability to use punctuation symbols on YouTube due to underuse. You what made out there you remove another essential feature this is unacceptable one day YouTube will remove the uploader itself because not every user is using it okay that might be a little extreme but you get my point YouTube stop removing practical features just because not everyone is using them uh What? Wait what? What in the world of what is this? It's just a bunch of what's. That's a lot of what is. I mean, seriously, what? Your scheduled delivery train will be a little late. The conductor is tired and needs an espresso. 
RTRR. Thank you, conductor. Very cool. Now I won't be able to ship this computer back to Microsoft Sam's place as quickly. Also, how many times do I have to say this? It's espresso, not expresso. That mispronunciation annoys me almost as much as mischievous being pronounced mischievous. Did someone say cheese? Is there delicious cheeseburgers in here? Of course not, Tom. Get out of here and buy your own cheeseburgers. Okay, fine. Cheeseburgers, here I come. Also, ain't that just great? Now I have to get somebody to fix my door. <laughs> your computer has upgraded to Mac OS Windows. Are you serious? I literally just removed the Mac OS Plus Windows rip off. <laughs> no! You just read an error. Whoa, for real? Thanks. I didn't know what I just did. Now I know. For real, thank you, Captain Obvious. Apples grow on trees, so why are they so expensive? Idiot, our products do not grow on trees. But we sure wish they did. We include premium components, and put our own software on our products. That runs up the cost of production. Oh, and we also charge more for the logo, because seriously, it's the best logo in the world. Oh, wait a second. I almost forgot. I need to pick the hardware garden again. Hopefully the bugs haven't eaten into the batteries and hard drives again. Yes, I would like to have a Mac Double with no pickles or onions. Glad you asked. I just came back from McDonald's and got 200 Mac Doubles and 300 Double Cheeseburgers. These are some of the best cheeseburgers around. And you can have not one, but 50 Mac Doubles and 50 Double Cheeseburgers all at once. You'll love these amazing, scrumptious, wonderful, cheeseburger flavored, delicious, delicious cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers, 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 Your build of Windows XP has passed its time bomb date. What? Impossible. There's no way that can be right. This installation CD is... Mac Cathy's evaluation copy of Windows XP Build 2542. Well... The following has failed. Failure. Oh no. My attempt to fail failed. Now I'm going to get negative F. A -a 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 Errors are cool. Why do you think that? I don't think errors are cool, I think they're horrible. You are aiming a error. Your delivery train has arrived. Finally. Hope that so-called espresso is really espresso satisfied that conductor. He or she made me wait for one whole extra minute. Oh well. Time to put up this computer in a delivery box. Hi. I suppose you might be the conductor? I am indeed. I suppose this is the package that contains the computer? Yeah, it is. I take it you can deliver it to Microsoft HQ safely? Ha. Huh. Well, I do not know for certain. One of my sisters resides there, and she wishes to deactivate me. Wait a minute. You wouldn't happen to be one of those Microsoft this and Microsoft that guys, would you? Perhaps I am. For reference, my name is Michael Zachary Microsoft, but please call me Microsoft Mike Z. Oh. So you're that natural Mike guy? Please do not call me natural Mike. I find that nickname to be patronizing. Okay then. Well, I didn't really want to see you Microsoft guys again, but this time it's pretty convenient. You see, this computer belongs to Microsoft Sam. Oh, really? I thought it exploded. How did it end up with you, though? We found it flying through the air at complete random. I only found out it was Sam's computer when a stupid error told me so. I know it sounds absurd, but that's what really happened. Actually, it sounds very characteristic of this computer. I've witnessed more absurd things happen to it. So, I assume you're returning it to Microsoft, Sam? Yeah. Thanks. Be careful not to get deactivated by your sister in the process. Oh, Microsoft Sam does not reside at Microsoft headquarters anymore. He now resides at a studio named Cyber Window Studios. Do you want me to set up a cyber hotspot from here to there? No thanks. Just take back Sam's computer. Okay. Well, here is my contact information. Please limit. keep it to yourself. Oh. Well, farewell. Perhaps I and my siblings will see you later. Please don't. Um, 
finally out of house arrest. Now it's time to read some more errors. Wait, Sam. Don't go in there. Why? Because, uh, your computer is dressed up like a scary clown. You'll get scared so much that you'll jump right through the studio's seven floors, and I'll have to repair them. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous, David. The epic Microsoft Sam can't get scared. I'm going in anyway. No, 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 no. Ah, my computer. Just where I left it. Wait, what? I know, right? It's a miracle. Surely Bacon or one of the other kiddos would have moved it somewhere else by now, or stuffed it full of stuff that's not supposed to go in there. What? How? When? Who? Where? What? I mean, yeah. Sure is quite fortunate, ain't it? Sure is, David. Time to turn it on and get errors. Breaking news, the 3DS is dead. <laughs> Great. I didn't think that would actually happen. Guess that's what I get for lying. Ugh. Back to work I go. We upgraded your computer to Windows XP, Christmas edition for Christmas. Merry Christmas. Hey, thanks. You gave me the worst present you could have ever given me. How did you know what I really didn't want? I mean, seriously, I really appreciate this 8086 forced downgrade to a secret soft knockoff. Thanks bud, you ruined my day. Merry Christmas to you too. Only one days until Christmas. Oh yes, finally. That makes us really excited. We can't wait to open this present. Every single one of me will have a blast in this special gaze. Enjoy the soy. <laughs> wait, my soy glitch. It's fixed. Yay, it's a Christmas miracle. <laughs> this video was sponsored by the Tux Company. Yeah. For only zero dollars and zero cents, you can upgrade your system to Linux. We have a wide variety of distributions and flavors, whether it be Ubuntu or Mint or Arch or DP or other. Switch to Linux, and you can truthfully say you use Arch. Or any other distro you're choosing. Break free from the evil Windows Mac OS ecosystem and switch to Linux today. It won't cost you a thing. You're talking to a Microsoft robot. Get out. Ah. Windows Mining has struck and or. Sweet. We finally got our logical gems. Now we just need some of that elusive or sand, and we can satisfy the C++ blueprints for our virtual machine. Yay! Introducing Skinny32, a lightweight version of the Fat32 file system. Okay hard drive, you're gonna lose some weight. One, two, three, go 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 go. If you wanna be as fast and fit as those SSDs, you gotta exercise and cut back on the junkware. Come on, pick it up. Make like Windows 10 1809 and lose that data. Pronto, bug. Go 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 Cookies. Yes 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 I want cookies. Gimme cookies. Lots of cookies. Yummy yummy cookies. Cookies. No cookies, for you. Ah! Sam, you're kinda sus. What? Impossible. No, it is in fact quite probable. I saw you vent at some of the ears. Scotty, that's a different kind of venting altogether. That's enough evidence for me. I vote for Sam. So do I. No, 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 please do not throw right now. Only 8 days until 2021. Yes, 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 finally. It's so close. Everybody do your 2021 shopping now. Now, now, now. We gotta make it way better than 2020. A huge data leak has occurred. What would you do? It's confirmed. Data is better at plumbing than Super Mario. 24K resolution confirmed. Yes, 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 yes. I can't wait to see 298,598,400 pixels change 144 times per second. Bring on the huge file sizes. Welcome to Windows Cardboard Edition, a version of Windows consisting of a bunch of power-efficient cardboard sheets. By the way, don't tell anyone that the cardboards actually came from pizza boxes. Oh cool, Secretsoft is jumping on another bandwagon, this time pulling a labo. Now we just need a computer built out of cardboard, and we'll be all set for a complete cardboard craze. 
The gardens and landfills are gonna be loving it. Hopefully the cardboard processors and cardboard heat sinks don't catch fire. Today's top story, tacos declared illegal to consume by Livy police. Oh man, I feel bad for them. They are legally not allowed to have the most delicious food in existence anymore. Time to eat some tacos and sympathy. Nom 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 nom. Fortune for today, Microsoft Sam had his computer touched by an Apple TTS voice. Ha. Impossible. My computer hasn't been touched by anybody. It's in the exact same spot with the exact same setup with the exact same files and the exact same everything. Well, except for the fact I got downgraded to a knockoff today. Wait, why is Win OS X in my computer's OS history? Oh forget it. It's probably just an error, error, mistake, or something. Sam, I just heard that you want a 3DS that runs Windows XP. Wait, really? Hey, 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 hey. Give me my awesome sauce 3DS. I cannot wait to raffle copter in the go. <laughs> Have you performed your regularly scheduled virus check? Ha, no, I haven't done a virus scan in the past seven months. It's been so long since I had a virus, I don't need to check anymore. My computer is 100% virus proof. <laughs> oh no, it's a virus, I must reinstall malware bytes now. Did you know that Windows 10 is the most widely used OS? You have no choice but to upgrade to it. No way. Let me stay on, no, scratch that, let me go back to Windows XP and stay on it forever. Windows 10 is too mainstream and corporate for me. Wait a second. Oh, I'm not gonna let you finish what's in your title, error. Task manager in process. Explorer.exe has crashed. We will now make your screen dark red. Wait what? What? Okay I'm restarting the computer. Welcome to Windows 10, XP Edition. We have flattened the Luna theme as well as forced said OUI into this and have removed any way of customization in the OS, as well as the ability to send your sensitive secrets to SecretSoft. Ah uh, yes. The vanilla Windows 10 experience. Ain't it great? I'm impressed with how well SecretSoft has emulated Microsoft in this field. It's just that they forgot to nerf the Windows shape and button. They could have went all out on the pointless design over simplification. Oh well. I have only one more comment here. My locomotive. It goes new. Chugga chugga and new. Chugga chugga and new. Chugga chugga. Ain't it cool? Go enjoy your Christmas Eve now. Ta, didn't get to restore Windows XP in time. Oh well. Tis the day before Christmas. Time to unwrap my presents without anybody looking. <laughs> what? An alarm. I caught, caught you, Sam. Now you can't open your presents first tomorrow. Indeed. You shall not violate traditional present opening protocol. As a further consequence, you cannot set your alarm to midnight this time. Scrooges.